everyone, welcome back to Three Dogs in an RV. My name is Stuart. Melissa. And welcome to our channel. Long story short, Missy and I. Well, why don't you tell the story, Missy? So we sold everything uh, in less than a month and moved into our RV full time. So we've been full time RV living for about six months now. And I'm not gonna say I love it, but I like it. Still getting used to it. But today we're at Mr. M's restaurant in Niagara Falls, New York. And we're gonna go try out some, have some, a different place for pizza and wings. So let's go in and uh, see what Mr. M's has to offer us. So Missy, we're here at the Mr. M's on Military Road in Niagara Falls, New York. Yes. So we ordered our normal half a tray of pizza. Pizza and wings. Which is what, 12 slices of pizza? Yep. 20 chicken wings, medium. Yep. And Ranch you ordered and you and you ordered some weird appetizer. Or yeah, rice, sausage. Rice it's balls sausage. with sausage. Yeah. I'm so. hungry. I want to eat something right so. away. And I know how long pizza takes and I know how long wings take. So here we are, Any here's Mr. M's. Looks like a half decent place, typical, yeah. I think your typical bar. No, we are early, so that's why that's it right. appears empty. That's right, but um, <laughs> you know, this is something that Niagara Falls, New York was known for mm. when we were growing up. Our, uh, our families would come over here on a Friday or Saturday and do what we're doing. And we always went to the same places because they were really good. Yeah, what was it, like Joey's own, no, not Joe, uh, Joey's and then Honey's. Honey's. Shorty's. Um, the Press Box. Anchor Bar. No, Anchor Bar was in Buffalo. That's true. Um, the one on Pine um, that everyone went to. The Overflow. Pete's Market. Well, Pete's Market wasn't a bar per se like this. It was more of a steakhouse. Wow. I don't know. We went there for pizza and wings, and pizza, they, sold. They, they never had pizza wings at Peach Market. Yes, never, they, they never had wings. Never did. Yes, they did. Never did. Well, we went for wings, and they would have buckets of beer, so it would be what I call a. Bucket. I think you're getting it confused with another place. It must be because I don't remember. They started the overflow because it was so busy all the time, and the I, overflow was I, right across I remember, the road from it. I remember going to Peach Market for steak and world famous shrimp cocktail. Okay. Well. I would have to get back to you on that, on what place I'm thinking about, but they were so busy, they opened another restaurant right across the road, and it was oh, called the Oak. Peach Market was always busy. And it was called the Overflow. Do you're you remember that? I don't remember that, but you're probably not wrong. Okay, well, we used to go there after, my dad used to play hockey on a hockey team, and we would go there after he played hockey, and most of the team would be there. So, and it was for pizza and wings. So we went, yeah, but we went, so I remember doing the same thing, but we went to the one with the elephant in front. It's called- Oh, Sunny's? It, it's was called it Short, Shorty's. Shorty's, that one, it was something else before that. Yeah. <clears throat> then you used to the, the press box. But now it's closed. They're all closed. Yeah, true. <clears throat> Meg Niagara Falls, New York turned into a ghost town for the yeah, longest time. Yeah, 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 so, yeah. So, anyway, so that's, uh, yeah, no, if anybody knows the difference, you know, what the great great restaurants in Niagara Falls, New York were growing up for pizza wings. And if, hey, if I'm wrong about Pete's Market, then please let me know. But I don't remember ever having pizza wings at Pete's Market. Yeah, I'm gonna, I remember having wings there, so, uh, but I can double check. All right, well, leave a comment below. Maybe we're getting it confused. Leave a comment below and let us know what your favorite wing and pizza place was in Niagara Falls, New York. And is today. It, and what it is because today. Because we need a good place to go. Yeah. <laughs> We used to go to Mr. B's, which yeah. is, I don't know if it's related to Mr. M's. I don't know if it is or not. Coincidence. Coincidence? Yeah. We used to go to Mr. B's, but Missy doesn't like that they put some sort of oregano. Uh, basil. Basil into their pizza, which. Right on top of the pizza. It just gives it a totally different taste. I don't know why they started doing that. We love Gangsters, but Gangsters, uh, the last time we checked, was only takeout only. Right. And you don't want to sit in your car to eat pizza. I don't want to, yeah, I don't want to sit in my car. <laughs> I don't want to take it back to the RV. No. So, uh, yeah. So here we are trying a new place. Here we are trying a new place. We'll let you know when our food arrives, what it looks like. Just then. All right, so Missy's big rice balls have arrived. So what are these, Missy? And they're rice, sausage, a bunch of stuff, breaded, deep fried, 
Well, why don't you cut into one? Let's have a look. This spaghetti sauce. Oh. Oh, it looks pretty yummy. It's, uh, it's a rice take a, ball. Take a bite and let's see what it goes. Wow. I'm, I'm trying to got it over. There you go, look at that. I'm going to use the sauce. Yes. Because I can't wait to see if this sauce is uh, it looks sugary. Like, it looks good. It does look good. You're making a mess of that. Okay, it's going to be you're, hot. You're making a mess of that. Mm. Really it's good. good. Oh, it's, it's really good. close. Is it good? Mm hmm. All right, so what is this? The rice sausage balls? Rice ball. Rice balls. All right. Let's try it out. I'm excited. Yes, yeah, Missy's a little excited. So this it looks is, good. This is your typical half tray pizza, famous in Niagara Falls, New York. I really haven't seen it anywhere else. All right? No, my mom makes it like this. I know, but yeah, but yeah, marketing, yeah. marketing it this way. Yeah. Because what is a hot, what is called half a tray yeah. is actually a whole tray. That's right. <laughs> there you go. And then the most important piece of all, the, the wings. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Thank you Anything very much. Else? No, we're good. I think we're good. Yeah. Thank you. Look at those. Ooh, they smell good too. Oh, I need uh, ranch dressing. Buffalo, like Buffalo, New York, blue style, blue cheese. Because there is only one type of blue cheese for wings. So we're gonna go and dig in. We'll uh, check in and uh, let you know how this is going. But uh, it uh, looks really yummy. Mhm. Mm yeah. Good. Nobody will like it. It's not that good. No, uh -huh. it's freaking awesome. All right. So Missy. Mm -hmm. Early. Uh, any thoughts early on in your? Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Yep, bingo, Ooh. found another one. Good place. Yeah, there you go. So, uh, no, I'm gonna demonstrate the right way to, to uh, <laughs> dip a chicken wing. So you take your chicken wing. Now this, these things are not, these things aren't the greatest, but you, you then you have to like rub it around so it's all over. And it really, blue cheese is the only acceptable dressing. I know you feel differently, but blue cheese, to me, is only, the only acceptable one. I use ranch. She uses ranch. But most Canadians do. Really. I don't know, it's a Canadian thing? I mean, I grew up in this area. I grew up in this area, so I was accustomed to blue cheese, but... It's a taste preference. Some people do not like blue cheese. I do not like blue cheese. There you go. There you go. All right, we're going to go and finish our dinner. A little longer than a few minutes later... Well, here's a pleasant surprise. <laughs> After stuffing our face with pizza and wings, <laughs> we're taking two boxes of pizza home, it looks like. We get some cannolis. Included with the meal. Included so with the meal. You so can't go wrong with can't that. can't go wrong with that. <laughs> All right, so we're going to force feed these I cannolis. I will dig in. Force feed these cannolis. Look. Mm. Good cannoli? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, we're going to go and eat this cannoli. All right, so we're done our uh, dinner at Mr. M's here in Niagara Falls, New York. Missy, what do you think? What are your thoughts on that? So, it was good. The pizza was good. The wings were good. The free cannolis. Uh, can't say no to those, and those were good. Um, all good. The the service could be better, but let's do hey. let's do this. What are three things you like about <laughs> Mr. M's? And what are three things you don't like about Mr. Uh, pizza, wings, cannolis. Okay, those three things you like. <laughs> um, the rice balls were really good too, by but the way. You can't have four. And three. the sauce, funny enough, it's was raining. not super sweet. So I really it's, like the sauce. It's raining out. The service could have been better, that's all. Yeah, my biggest complaint would be the service. But uh, I can forgive poor service for good food. Yeah, and it was 45 bucks. I can't forgive... So, good service with bad food. food. Yeah, true. And the food was uh, great. So I yeah. I left a Google review saying, I think I just found my next favorite wing and pizza Ooh. place in Niagara Falls. That's saying a lot. It is, because... Yes. We've I'm been very, going to Gangster since, gosh, I yeah. don't know when. So, two thumbs up for Mr. M's in Niagara Falls. If you're uh, looking for a place to eat, stop by here if you're a big wing and pizza fan. They have other things. Yeah. But I... I we didn't even try we them. We didn't try them. Except for the rice balls. Yeah, which were good. 
So we're taking two boxes of pizza home with us, so we're gonna have lots of leftovers for the rest of the week. So yeah, stop by here, check uh, it out. For lunch tomorrow. For lunch tomorrow. For the tomorrow. rest of the week. <laughs> and uh, and thanks for uh, thanks for tuning in to Three Dogs in an RV. Our, we're gonna try to do more of these uh, little reviews of places we go to eat yeah. more often. But uh, hit that subscribe button below, leave us a comment, let us know what you think about uh, Mr. M's if you had here. What's your favorite wing and pizza place in Niagara Falls? And, uh, and who uses ranch and who uses blue and cheese? They settle the because that's a huge thing settle, between us too. Settle the argument: <laughs> blue cheese or ranch? Yay, ranch! With your chicken wings, I say blue cheese, and obviously, she says ranch. Yes. All right. Thanks for tuning in to Three Dogs in RV. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment below. Bye.